What's up, guys? Back here again today. Um, <clears throat> been like I haven't, I didn't make a video mainly this week's Thursday now, but I got my little off-brand GoPro thing in, and it's okay, but nothing too special. <laughs> but it's okay. But I think I'm gonna start videoing with that thing whenever uh, we go to the ride parks, cause I have like you can have like a 32 gigabyte card in it. So I'll be good for the riding parks. But here's, I have nothing else for the video since it's like, it's not working at a riding park right now, so there's nothing to do. But, uh, I don't know. Just do like a little Foreman 450 update with all my stuff on. So as y'all know, of course, this Mud Light 27 inch XL tires. Got my light pods on, hooked up now. Yeah, you can see those. Um, currently right now, I am sanding down my frame, some some sandpaper trying to get smooth, so I'm going to paint the front of my frame, but it's kind of, kind of ugly. And if y'all don't know, right here, it's supposed to be like a little metal skid plate. I took that off because it looked bad, it was all bent up and stuff, and I don't know. I mean, I might risk like something just like hitting my differential and like cracking it, but I don't know. And also, oh, big update. <laughs> Not a good update though. Um, and of course, this thing has how many miles? Does this thing have almost seven thousand miles on it now. So my rear differential is going to need seals on this side because the oil is starting to come out of here. Finally, and like when I changed the oil the other day, it was like not too good looking. So I'm going to get seals for that. Probably some bearings. Fix that up. Just typical maintenance when you mud with a four wheeler. But it's all worth it. <clears throat> I mean, this thing at the riding park at Mud Creek, or I mean, uh, River Run, did so good the other day. I mean, well, a couple weeks ago. I mean, these 27 inch t tires, Mud Lights, I mean, just, they're 27 inch Mud Light XLs. I mean, and they did so good. I don't even know why I'd need anything bigger, really. I, I love them. I hardly got stuck, and I went through a lot of crap. Like, I went through one hole. I mean, it was so bad. When you got down in it, it was just like... I, I didn't get on video, though, but, like, when I went in it, like, I was stuck, basically. But, like, I was like, oh, I'm so screwed. But, so, I, I, what I did, I stood on the front rack right here, and I started just giving it gas, rocking it, and I got back on it, and I, like, crawled out of it. Eventually, though, I have these 27-inch Mud Light XLs on. I love them. And I'm probably eventually going to get, like, some 28-inch tires eventually in the gear reduction. But that's in the future. Right now, I'm pretty much done doing what I, ha I want to do to it. But I think I'm going to do one more thing. I have a winch for it, like a Harbor Freight winch, like a 2,500-pound one. I want to mount it right here. I need to give me a mounting plate. I need a winch. Every four-wheeler that you ride in Mud Park needs a winch. But yeah, nothing else to do around here. Since I've been going to school all week, I uh, haven't really been able to do anything to do. So when I get home, it's almost dark. It's a stupid daylight savings time thing. And you can't really do anything anymore. So I haven't even rode a four-wheeler since Sunday. It's already Thursday now. I probably want to get a really good ride in a day. But yeah, here's like a little quick video. Nothing else to really video around here. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for today. Peace.